So good morning, guys. Um, I'm at the laundromat. <laughs> it's, uh, I got a watch on today, 7.26 in the morning, bright and early in the morning. There's only like one other person in here. I always tell you guys, I like to go early. I don't like to be around people. It's just easier to go early. I've already taken my shower at the gym. I'm doing my laundry. And then at 9 a.m. I have to get an oil change. I'm a lot of miles on my vehicle. And then today, guys, I'm gonna be camping at a horse sanctuary. It's a place where they rescue horses, they train them and they rehome them, home them. So yeah, today is going to be a uh, camping video. Uh, and I'm just gonna be cooking what I have in the fridge. I'm gonna go through, see what I have and put something together. I'm not gonna go buy anything or anything like that. I'm just trying to use up my food. So after this um, oil change, then um, we'll be heading out uh, a little later on to uh, start our camping trip. I'm super excited. This should be an interesting day. So right now I'm on my way to go get my gas, my gas. <laughs> Can I talk? I'm on my way to go get my oil change and uh, looking at the forecast because it's just really gray and muggy skies. Um, we're supposed to get rain, kind of snow mix today for a few hours. And then it's supposed to rain all night tonight. So yeah, we'll see how uh, today turns out because of the uh, place where I'm going to, I think they said there's mud. But I think I'm parking on gravel, so let's hope it's gravel that I'm parking on and not mud. And then uh, the rain, it'll be hard to get out of. And so, yeah, uh, the wind is incredible. It's dragging me like a rag doll. I will see you guys when I, uh, I'm at the place where I'm getting my oil change. I'll see you guys in a bit. We are here and they are open so let's get started all right services hopefully we can yeah we can fit let's see how much they open it because our bad our baby is nine and a half feet high uh, 9.2 9.3 let's see how high that goes and yeah we are good to go We are here. We are leaving. Everything looked good. Multi point inspection, all the fluid levels, everything checked out. So let's let's get out of here. I'm a happy camper. Yes, yes, yes. Since Chick-fil-A is in the area, I'm gonna try Chick-fil-A's breakfast. Um, they stopped serving breakfast at 10.30. I'll get there at about 10.17. So I heard they have really good breakfast, guys. So, you know, I'm already a Chick-fil-A fan from trying their chicken sandwich and uh, the macaroni. So let's try a chicken biscuit. I'll see you guys when I get there. We are here and we got like eight minutes until they stop serving breakfast and I don't think I'm gonna make it, but we'll see. Cause I have my, who wants a, who wants dinner or lunch at, at 10, who wants lunch at 10.30 in the morning? I certainly don't. So we are at Chick-fil-A and I'm gonna park and run in real quick. Uh, this is organized. All right, let's go in and get some uh, breakfast. Chick-fil-A guys, there we are. I'll see you inside. Did we make breakfast? Did we make breakfast? Did we make breakfast? Is it gonna be a dine in or a carry out? Carry out, please. I got some, what is that, tater tots or hash browns? I said tater tots. And I got a chicken biscuit. Let's just keep the chicken going. Look at these cute little hash browns. Come on, Chick-fil-A. Give me more than that. Oh, good. Mmm. Here, have a hash brown. Nice. Now the chicken biscuit. 
Wow, that's big and juicy. Look at that biscuit. I'm gonna try their Chick-fil-A sauce on the biscuit, which I don't know how that's gonna taste because I'm so used to putting jam on my breakfast sandwich. So we're gonna throw jam on this. Or jam. We're gonna throw Chick-fil-A sauce on it. Here you go, guys. First bite goes to you. Have that bite right there. Good. Here we go. My first time ever trying Chick-fil-A breakfast. Oh my goodness. Wow. The breakfast sandwich is freaking to die for. Mm, mm, mm. 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 Good call on the Chick-fil-A sauce. Mmm. Mm -mm. To die for. Wow. This is nice. Mmm. The biscuit is so soft. Mm -mm -mm. have another bite this corner wow it's so good mm. Mm -mm -mm. this biscuit is so fresh it tastes like they pulled it out the oven Here, have some. Mm, mm, mm. Four minutes out we're almost there um uh definitely this area is uh all farm lots and lots and lots and lots of farmland uh so i will hit you guys up when we get there like i said we're about three or four minutes out i'll see you guys when i get there we are here in the horse sanctuary reality chance rescue Look at those beautiful horses. Um, they said I can park anywhere on the gravel as long as I'm not blocking the entrance or anything like that. Look at the beautiful horses. Oh my goodness. Um, like I was saying earlier, I've only ever, I literally don't know where to park. I'm gonna figure out where to park and then I'll get back with you guys. So I'm here and I talked to someone who worked here and she told me where to park. So I'm, I'm already parked and set. I'll show you guys where I'm at when I get out. And then she said we can look around, walk around and take a look at the horses as long as we don't go inside of the barns that we can take a look. So this is wonderful. That's the view. Uh, that's the view looking out my kitchen window. And then that's the view looking out my side window. Pretty, pretty nice. Let's go look at some horses. Ugh. This is where I'm parked and there's horses like you can see them. Let's see, with my little short self, I think this is okay uh, to walk on this grass. You see the horses? Like right there. That'd be so cool if they came up to the fence, but I doubt it. And then there's horses right there. There's one right there. And then there's where I'm parked. So these are where the horses are. And uh I have literally, <laughs> this is so cool. So peaceful. She said I could walk around. Look at the horses. Hey! Are they coming up to me? No way. No way. No way. Hey! No way. <gasps> what? 
Are they coming up to me? No, they're not. Oh my god. Hey! Oh, wow. Look at those horses. Wow. No way. No, what? No. What? What? No way. Hey! I just can't even. I'm too scared to stick my hand out. There's no way. Target. That's a, looks like a male horse. Hey, all right, see ya. I'll give you your piece, let you eat. Wow, they're so muscular. This place is nice. They got benches where you can sit down if you get tired. Wow. Look at these horses. Hey! Look at those horses. Let's see if we can zoom in. Wow, those are beautiful horses. I think it's feeding time. Got little benches where you can sit down and eat. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Wow, that horse is beautiful. Family, look at me. Uh, I'm gonna back up a little bit. I can't. Mm -mm. Hi! I, can't. I literally can't. Hi! Yeah, okay, we're gonna leave. Alright, yeah, I just. So yeah. is like if you don't leave me alone it's feeding time yeah i don't know if i want to touch him i'm not experienced but i don't think horses attack people this he seems pretty friendly i want to pet him but i i can't bring myself to do it i, I have no experience with horses so I'm not i literally could not pet that horse <laughs> I have no experience. Um, I don't know what I'm doing and I don't know if horses attack. It's a beautiful horse. I'm just not experienced enough. So I just prefer to look at him. But it was so cool. He came to me. What am I? What am I the horse whisperer? Am I in the wrong field? Should I become a horse trainer or something? I think I could talk to horses. I know some of y'all are probably screaming, pet the horse, pet him. I, I, I have no experience. I literally don't know. So I just rather look at him and stick my little hand out and then it's gone. It was a cute horse though. So right now, <laughs> I'm going to go see if I can get a selfie with one of these horses and that's going to be my thumbnail. You think I can get a selfie? You think they'll come up to me again and get a selfie? Yeah, let's go get a selfie. This will be my thumbnail. They are eating. Look how beautiful they are. I think I got a good selfie. Look how beautiful. I don't think you guys realize. Well, I'm sure some of you do, but just how big they are. Oh, they got their cute little jackets on. Aw, cute selves. Alright guys, I'll let you eat. In peace. Alright guys, I'm going to pet them.
pet you. I can't pet you, buddy. I, <laughs> your old head's over. <laughs> hey, I can't. I'm sorry. <laughs> I pet him. I just... <laughs> Right now, um, as it stands, as of 3.20 in the afternoon, um, there are no other campers. Uh, let's look outside so I can show you guys. We can pretty much park wherever there's not an entrance, which is pretty cool, but I decided to park here. Um, from my camper, there are no other campers. I mean, I can literally park like in that area or down there, but I think it's just cool right here. Um, it would be kind of cool to park down there, but I am kind of there. What? Guys, there are roosters. I knew I heard a rooster like going, ar, ar. I'm like, am I hearing things? Like, oh, roosters down there. We're going to go check those bad boys out in the morning. It's probably going to wake me up. But as it stands, there are another camper. So I'm going to leave my door for a little bit, let it air out, and then we'll get it back warm. And then if you look down here, there are no other campers either. I'm kind of getting used to liking the be alone thing. When I do my little stealth camping videos where I'm isolated or by myself, I actually kind of like it. I'm starting to like it. At first I didn't, but now I'm getting used to it. And I think it's getting me ready for full-time travel when I start camping in areas where there are like a lot of like wilderness, a lot of BLM lands, a lot of federal lands like uh, Utah, Colorado, Wyoming. I, well, I heard Wyoming's really nice. I, I can't wait to actually visit Wyoming um, as well, but I'm getting used to it. So right now I'm going to... As you can see, I got my pillow. I'm going to get my bed together and uh, I'm going to relax. I was driving, guys. Let me show you. I was driving and I almost missed my turn and I should have kept going because this, this fell off. I hit my brakes. There was nobody behind me, but I was in the middle of really nowhere and I hit my brakes and this thing fell off and you see the crack and it hit this. That's okay, but I'm going to fix it. It's not a big deal, but yeah, so I'm going to get my bed together. I'm going to relax layout i'm kind of letting my van air out a little bit this is kind of what i do as well i'll air out my van every once in a blue moon i was going through my storage guys and i found my iphone watch that i bought like i don't know four years five years ago this thing is super old but um, i'm starting to use it now it's like if i buy it i should use it so yep there's that but all right, I'll see you guys in a... Oh, that car right there is a, someone who works here. She's out, I think, feeding the horses or, you know, doing whatever duty she has to do for the day. But this place closes at 8, so after 8, I'll be super alone. It'll be dark out, so... All right, guys, I'm going to get my bed set up. I'm going to close the door, and uh, I'm going to relax. I'll see you guys for dinner. fam uh, i'm chilling in my car or my van and i just got this beautiful looking horse just staring at just staring out into the distance feet for me hey hey Let's see if we can get him to come over here hey buddy ah uh, heck no nah. no nah, no way hey buddy hey oh <laughs> like we are we we're just chilling in the van hey buddy you don't pay me no attention do you ah uh, let me get my shoes oh come on let me get my shoes and see if i can run over there before they leave i haven't got to pet this horse oh he's peeing <laughs> hey buddy how are you oh wow this one kind of i don't know if i want to touch this one or not but hey buddy you doing all right Hey. All right, let's get back in our my van. Like, I'm chilling in my van. And Goliath. <laughs> Goliath. Let me get the keys. Goliath. Oh, you wanna you want me to pet you? Okay. Hey buddy. You had to pee, huh? How you doing? You're beautiful. No, okay. Okay, you're beautiful. Let's get a selfie. Hey, let's do intro. Let's do a selfie. Introvert on three. Oh, they y'all not introverts. Oh, oh, you go. All right, they're not introverts. So let me clean off my shoes. I'll be right back.
finished results, guys. Rest of the chicken that I had, um, some noodles, that chili pepper oil, a little bit of almond butter, hoisin sauce, and sweet soy sauce. Dinner. Here, first bite goes to you guys. I don't feel like getting a fork, so take a bite. There you go. First bite. It's good, huh? I could eat this every day. Mmm, this is so good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. The only thing I couldn't eat every day is the chicken. I think I would get tired of chicken. But these noodles and the, the rest of the sauces, every day I could eat it. Very, it's spicy, it's flavorful, it's so, so good. Mm. From breakfast this morning, I didn't eat lunch, but from breakfast this morning, I'm chickened out. I literally cannot do any more chicken after today. It's so windy outside. And to my knowledge, I don't think anybody else has come in. I think I'm the only one here. We'll see in the morning if there's any other campers when we look outside. Mm. Yeah, I should have got a fork, but here you go. Have that bite right there. I mean, can the chicken stay on? There you go. It's good, huh? Um, I enjoyed my stay here. I would definitely do it again so far. Um, the horses are super sweet. I'm just not used to an animal that big, like walking up to me. Uh, from a distance, the horses look small, but when they walked up to me, I was like, whoa, no, I'm scared. I ain't petting it. it the horses are, I can't, I couldn't do it. From a distance, oh, how cute. But when they walked up to me, I was like, uh-uh. You got me. I cannot. Like, literally. So that one horse I petted, that took a lot of guts from me. I don't even understand. Because I didn't realize how big horses are. Like, one, I only had one other encounter with a horse, and that was when I was in the military. That was years ago. And I read a I I was, uh, I did a horse. I rode a, man, I can't talk. I'm so tired. I rode a horse on a beach, but I was so scared and inexperienced. They gave me the smallest horse out of everybody. I think I had like a pony and the horse knew I was scared. So they treaded very lightly. They, they didn't go fast. Like the horse knew, like I didn't realize how smart horses are. But all in all, I had fun today. It was relaxing, but man, it was cold out. There you go. Only while I'll eat it hot and spicy. Mm, mm, mm. I'm gonna try my hot water bottle today for the first time. <clears throat> it's not that cold in here, but I want to try it just because I haven't used it yet. Ooh, and I'll let you know in the morning how the hot water bottle goes. Ooh, this is hot. Mmm. <laughs> While we're waiting, we're going to get this hot water bottle together. So, I'm going to finish the rest of this. 
and then I'm gonna come back on and make my hot water bottle and uh, I'm gonna get into bed. So I'll see you guys in a few minutes. Okay guys, so here's the hot water bottle. I've never used it, but there's water in it because I wanted to measure my water first before I boiled it. So hopefully I can do this without, you know, as pain, painless as possible. There we go. I'm not going to burn myself. There we go. I know there's a safer way to do it. I'll figure it out next time. But right now I'm tired. Ooh. Put that in the sleeping bag. I'm going to clean up um this finish off my dinner i'm almost done and uh i'm going to bed when i say i'm tired <laughs> have one more bite before i go have that bite very flavorful spicy mm. <sighs> big mess I'm going to clean this up and get back in this bed with this hot water bottle. When I say I am tired, I was dozing off. I'm going to brush my teeth, wash my face. And then I'm out of here. I'll see you guys in the morning. Good night. <sighs> Man, let me get up. Mm -mm -mm. Mm, come on, let's go. Let's get up. <sighs> Good morning, guys. Good morning. I slept amazing. It was so peaceful, so quiet. And it rained all night long. And when I say that wind was powerful, it was so powerful. You could hear it. My van was rocking a little bit. I was comfortable. It's about 6.40 in the morning. I got to get up, prepare my van for departure. Uh, the horse sanctuary opens up at 8, so I want to be gone by 8. So I'm going to get up, put everything away, get dressed. Oh, and that hot water bottle. Oh my gosh, my whole body was amazing. It felt so good. Oh, man. All right, let me get up, get ready to go, wipe everything down, put these, put this stuff up. What's the temperature in the van? Oh, <laughs> guys, it's on the floor. I'll let you know the temperature when I get up. Uh, I'll get up and I'll see you in a minute. I'll see you in a minute. Time is 7.03 and we're, it's still pitch black out. I'm gonna put my headlights on a little higher so you guys can see. Um, We're still here. Can't see the horses, they're probably asleep. But um, no one's here, but we're gonna get ready to get out of here and uh, take our time because it's a lot of back roads and hills and it's very, very dark and no lights. Um, so I wanna get out of here and, and uh, beat this traffic. <clears throat> Although I'll probably be stuck in traffic. So I really enjoyed myself. This is one last look. They have a few lights on out there. Uh, you know, a few out there, but uh, ah, there it is guys. Horses are probably knocked out sleep. I appreciate you guys coming along with me like I always do. I really enjoy your company. Um, I appreciate you spending just a little bit of your time with me. That means a lot to me. I hope you guys enjoyed our dinner last night, our conversation, as I know I do always enjoy our dinner uh, time and talks. But it's time for me to get out of here and uh, beat this traffic. It's a lot of back roads, a lot of hills, a lot of country roads. Not not a lot of lights. So I want to take my time and get up out of here. But I, I do appreciate you guys. Again, you guys are an awesome community. And uh, thank you guys for being so awesome. Thanks for watching. And as always, I will see you guys in my next video. Take care. Peace. Bye. We're out of here.